Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In today's video, we have one very interesting and challenging question from Math Olympiads. Equations are x square minus y square equal to 24, xy equal to 35. We have to evaluate x plus y. So let's get started by writing our method number one. From second equation, I can conclude x cannot be 0 and y also cannot be 0. So from this equation I can write y will be equal to 35 over x. And this value I will apply here in equation 1. So I will be writing x square minus y square equal to 24 or x square minus 35 square over x square equal to 24. Now a square minus b square identity. I can write a plus b times a minus b. Let's apply. So x plus 35 over x times x minus 35 over x equal to 24. Now I will consider squaring both sides. So power 2, power 2, power 2. Now I will use a plus b whole square identity here a minus b whole square identity here. So let us apply. I will be writing x plus 35 over x whole square x minus 35 over x whole square equal to 24 square. a plus b whole square x square plus 35 square over x square plus 2 times x times 35 over x. In second bracket, x square plus 35 square over x square minus 2 times x times 35 over x. And RHS is 24 square. Now we can cancel x and x, x and x. So it will be x square plus 35 square over x square plus 70. In the second bracket x square plus 35 over x square minus 70. And RHS is 24 square. Now this is a, if suppose this is b, then a plus b times a minus b. So I can write difference of two squares identity once again. So I will be writing x square plus 35 square over x square whole square minus 70 square. It will be equal to 24 square. I will add 70 square to both sides. x square plus 35 square over x square whole square. This will be equal to 24 square plus 70 square. x square plus 35 square over x square whole square equal to 24 square plus 70 square. 24 square is 576. 70 square is 4900. If I will add, it will be 5476, which is perfect square of 74. So left hand side, it is x square plus 35 square over x square whole square. Right hand side 74 square. I will take a square root both sides. 
सो एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस थर्टी फाइव स्क्वायर ओवर एक्स स्क्वायर विल बी इक्वल टू प्लस सेवेंटी फोर एंड माइनस सेवेंटी फोर नाउ आई विल बी राइटिंग एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस थर्टी फाइव स्क्वायर ओवर एक्स स्क्वायर इक्वल टू प्लस सेवेंटी फोर एंड एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस थर्टी फाइव स्क्वायर ओवर एक्स स्क्वायर इक्वल टू माइनस सेवेंटी फोर नाउ आई विल एड सेवेंटी टू बोथ साइड ऑफ द बोथ इक्वेशन सो आई विल राइटिंग हेयर प्लस सेवेंटी प्लस सेवेंटी हेयर ऑल्सो प्लस सेवेंटी इन एल एच एस प्लस सेवेंटी इन आर एच एस एंड सेवेंटी वी विल कंसिडर एज टू टाइम्स एक्स टाइम्स थर्टी फाइव ओवर एक्स नाउ यू कैन सी दिस इज एक्स होल स्क्वायर प्लस थर्टी फाइव ओवर एक्स होल स्क्वायर एंड देन वी हैव सेवेंटी एंड सेवेंटी इज टू टाइम्स एक्स टाइम्स थर्टी फाइव ओवर एक्स सो लेफ्ट हैंड साइड इट इज परफेक्ट स्क्वायर ऑफ एक्स प्लस थर्टी फाइव ओवर एक्स सिमिलरली इन दिस इक्वेशन दिस विल बी एक्स प्लस थर्टी फाइव ओवर एक्स होल स्क्वायर सो लेट मी राइट एक्स प्लस थर्टी फाइव ओवर एक्स होल स्क्वायर this will be equal to 74 plus 70 in first equation and in second equation x plus 35 over x whole square this will be equal to minus 74 plus 70 now right hand side if i will sum up then this is equal to 144 and lhs is x plus 35 over x whole square now i will write 144 as 12 square once i will consider square root both sides x plus 35 over x this will come out plus and minus 12 and 35 over x is our y Now come to the second equation. I will write here x plus thirty-five over x whole square. It will be equal to minus four. Now we know that minus one is i square. So I will be writing four times i square, and this is nothing but two i whole square. LHS is x plus y whole square. Let me write. Consider square root both sides. X plus y, it will be equal to plus and minus two i. So this value is complex, and here we are having real solutions. This was our method number one. Method number two. Here I will use. Algebraic identity. It is x square plus y square whole square equal to x square minus y square whole square plus four x square y square. Now I will apply x minus y. x square minus y square and x y value so i'll be writing here 24 whole square plus 4 times 35 whole square so 24 whole square is 576 and this value will be 4 times 1225 so 576 Plus four nine double zero, which will be equal to 
5476 and this is nothing but 74 whole square. So from LHS I will write x square plus y square whole square. This will be equal to 74 whole square. Consider square root both sides. So x square plus y square value will be plus minus 74. Now I will write, let me write here once, x square plus y square is equal to plus minus 74. Now I will write x plus y whole square. It is equal to x square plus y square plus 2xy. Now once I will consider plus 74. So I will be having 74 plus 2 times xy is 35. So 2xy will be 70. So 2 times 35 with plus sign and with minus sign I will write minus 74 plus 2 times 35. This is for minus and here it is for plus. So I can write 74 plus 70 and minus 4 minus 74 plus 70. So minus 4. So I will be writing 144 and negative 4. Same logic I will apply. I will write x plus y will be after taking a square root, it will be plus minus 12 and the same way we will write plus minus 2i as method number 1. Now let us consider method number 3. Here I will be writing x square minus y square is equal to 24 y is 35 over x so i will write 35 is square over x is square equal to 24 now x is non zero i can multiply both sides by x square so let's multiply x square times x square minus 35 square over x square equal to 24 times x square. Let's multiply, simplify LHS. x power 4 minus 35 square equal to 24 x square or x power 4 minus 24 x square minus 35 square it is equal to 0 or I can write x power 4 minus 24 x square and 35 square is 1225. Now this is quadratic equation in x square. So I can apply quadratic formula to calculate x square. x square will be equal to minus b so minus of minus 24 plus minus under the root b square so 24 square 576 minus 4ac so plus 4 times 1225 it will be 4900 divided by 2a so 2 so 24 plus minus this will be 5476. I am writing directly 74 divided by 2. This is nothing but our x square value. Now I will consider x square is equal to 24 plus 74. So 98 over 2, 49. And 24 minus 74. It will be equal to negative 50 over 2 so negative 25 now i can write 
x square is equal to 7 square and this I will write 5i whole square. After taking a square root, x will be equal to plus minus 7 and plus minus 5i. Now you can see if I will write the value of y here. Let me write y. y will be equal to 35 over x. So I will write 35 divided by x. So 35 over plus 7, it will be plus 5. 35 over minus 7, it will be minus 5. So I will write plus minus 5. This is our y for the value of x plus minus 7. Now y for x is equal to plus 5i. It will be 35 over 5i. So 7 over i. That means minus 7i. So with plus sign, it will be minus 7i. And with minus 5i, it will be plus 7i. So I have to calculate the x plus y. So I will write plus minus 7 plus minus 5 respective sign and second value plus minus 5i minus plus 7i. So I will write x plus y will be plus 7 plus 5 plus 12 minus 7 minus 5 minus 12. So plus minus 12 and here plus 5i minus 7i. So minus 2i and minus 5i plus 7i. So plus 2i. So plus minus 2i. This was our method number 3. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Bye bye.